Playboy Cardi is done for. And y'all calling him the N-word. I know a white nigga made this video. What y'all talking Yo, about? Yo, what's good, your niggas? You feel what I'm saying? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Today, I want to talk about Playboy Cardi and, like, his current state right now, you feel what I'm saying? Because, you know, he dropped these singles, like, about, like, one or two months ago. And, you know, we're, we've been wondering, where is the album? So, make sure to, like, comment, subscribe, notification bell. You know, ever since Cardi finessed Aiden Ross in his stream... Oh. I feel like I feel like the album has just been delayed more and more, you know. DJ Academic said it was gonna be dropping on January, and here we are in March. There's still no album, and it's just so crazy to me because. And so what? You frustrated because you can't get no album? Wait, nigga, fuck. That's why I know y'all niggas not real fans, bro. This nigga, this nigga have been he been having niggas wait forever, bro. Fuck. Niggas need to stop doing this shit. This is Fat Hands Burner. We gotta come catch Fat Hands. Cardi is the only rapper you can find where he's at 50 million monthly listeners. Do I like the mysterious turn? lies to his fans. That, it's not a so trend. It's just some shit that happened. It's been four years me? since Cardi dropped Hold Out of Red. And I don't know, but I'm like, I'm really like losing hope for this. Because, like, especially if it drops and if it's bad, like, I'm gonna be so mad, dude. Like, honestly. Like, I, I really just don't know what Cardi's cooking up in the studio right now for him to be taking this long. Because Cardi does have a history of lying. I mean, everyone knows this. Like, for the past, like, few years now in his career, like, he's just been lying to his fans. Oh, I'm gonna drop something. I'm gonna drop this. I'm gonna drop that. And then he checks. Cardi told you. He told y'all that he finna drop. He said that? Nah, I don't believe y'all. Spotify, or Apple Music, nothing is there. So it's really just, like, this annoying cycle that just keeps happening over and over again and it's really just hard to defend him ever since you know like i said the cardi and aiden thing which i'm actually going to talk about in my next it's week. hard to defend cardi oh uh, who's who's pressing you who's pressing you uh about cardi shit let me know what type of fans who's pressing you stand up talk about it nigga fuck No, bro, this nigga out here talking down on my goat, bro. Like, what's up, bro? Fuck, it's hard to defend Cardi. How is it hard to defend Cardi? People are the biggest artists in the world, nigga. He, he on Michael Jackson status. The fuck, nigga? It's hard to defend Cardi. Who's troubling you, nigga? Video, so stay in two for that. Like, like I said, it's been really hard to defend him and be like a fan of him. You know what I'm saying? Because oh, it's hard to be a fan. Don't be a fan no more. Leave. We don't need niggas like you. Fuck. If you're not a believer, leave. We don't need niggas like you over here in the opium. I don't need niggas like you. This is set for strong niggas, not for bitch niggas. Get the fuck on. Tired of niggas. Nah, for real. Cause like this nigga just don't drop music, bro. Like he's really like just like a bad person. Like he's thirty years old, doing this mysterious nonsense, trying to be mysterious so bad, and it's really just corny. Like this, like he can't just be like a regular person, like like he was in the Cash Cardi era, like the 2016, 2017. Nigga, you wasn't even there. What? <laughs> hey, during the Cash Cardi era, bro, 90% of all the music that you heard were mainly leaks, all right? Listen, 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 listen. This nigga Cardi did not want to drop. Do you not know how long it took for this nigga to drop the Cash Cardi tape? You know that when the Playboy Cardi self-titled album cover, before it was Cardi and the two bitches, bro, it was nothing but comments of, hey, when Cardi dropping, Cardi ain't gonna never drop this. Drop the album, drop the album, drop the album. Come on now. He was supposed to binge drop that shit. Look, if y'all niggas want an album, he gonna drop that shit whenever he wants. Stop crying and complaining like a bitch, bro. Don't be comparing this shit to Cash Cardi, bro, because this nigga's always been like this, bro. Like, for real. 2018 phase he can't really just can't be like that anymore like now he wants to be this gay bisexual vampire and want to like the most mysterious man in the world like dude like you're not you know what i'm saying like that doesn't give you like 
points or anything. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like you're just a regular human being. You know what I'm saying? Like, what? What? He thinks he's like, I don't know, like, like he's on top of everyone. Like, you just try to be a corny, mysterious vampire. Right? It's really oh, so when niggas try to be themselves, they just a corny, mysterious, gay, bisexual vampire. Okay. Okay, bro. See, all it is, and it, like I said, it's like it's just really hard to be a fan of him. Because this nigga, yes, like he dropped like a few songs, but, but like if you really think about it, like those five songs that he dropped are the album. That's literally all we're getting. Like no cap. That, that, is is that a problem? Y'all have a problem with that? Cardi dropped like five songs. It's better than nothing, right? Those five songs were the album and they're not on streaming services. When I tried to find them on SoundCloud, they're either like sped up or slowed down with reverb and I'm not trying to hear that. So I really- Download them. Stop being a bitch, bro. Download them, put them on your phone, nigga. You can put them on Apple Music, you can put them on Spotify. Download them, nigga. You gotta go to YouTube and listen to these songs. So it's just, I, I don't know, bro. Like, and yeah, he's been, he's had a few, a lot of features, you know, he's like Fiend, Carnival. So, you know what I'm saying? Like he's had some features, but I don't know, like, like we're still waiting for his own work. You know what I'm saying? When he was dropping those singles, like two months ago, I was really excited because like there was hope he was actually gonna drop, but like the fact that he just keeps lying over and over again. And we had a pretty reliable source too, DJ Academics. Oh, DJ Academics is the reliable source. <laughs> Man. Hey, if you went to Cardi News, go to DJ Academics. Damn. Hopefully somebody bring back awful Cardi, man. <laughs> and the reason why I say he's reliable is because in 2020, he said, you know, the album's gonna drop out Christmas or whatever, and it actually did so. You know, I was hoping that you know DJ Academics would be a reliable source here, but no album in January, Aww. so it's I don't know like who to trust anymore. Like, Damn, you got nobody to trust no more for Cardi dropping anymore. You've got to say like I'm really I don't know when the album's dropping, and if it doesn't come out this year, like I'm lucky done, bro. Like I'm still gonna listen to the nigga music, bro, but I just I can't be like a a fan of him. You know what I'm saying? Like, but yeah, man, Cardi, like you've got to say like I really just hope he really stops with the mysterious stuff because like the nigga, bro, like the whole like aura thing, like it just it's so like stupid to me. Like you've got to say like there's no need to be so mysterious I mean, I was like, there's no point there's literally no point like just be like you're a, just be a regular kid bro like, you gotta be like so like i don't know you get, you get what i'm saying i really just wish like like he really just needs to get back to his 2016 2017 era and i'm not talking about the music you niggas was never there for that why you want i don't understand why niggas want people to go back to an era that they missed so much when they wasn't even a part of that era Period. He was like, I'm talking about him as a person because it wasn't as mysterious. He was dropping music, especially before he dropped self-titled. He was dropping lots of music. So he ain't dropped them bitches. Them bitches got leaked, nigga. But yeah, man. I mean, I mean, everyone knows this. It's pretty obvious, especially ever since like he finessed Aiden like Aww. crazy. Like, that nigga's been on a streak, bro. Like just lying to his fans and just being like honestly, like just being so mean and rude. Like it's just. Like, it's weird, bro. But um. Yeah, man, that's pretty much all I have to say. I see today. how you put the sad music. Tomorrow I'm gonna upload a video on how streamers are like changing the rap game. So make sure to stay in tune for that. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and notification bell. And um, yeah, man, I have a lot of videos planned for y'all niggas. So y'all stay in tune. I have a lot of ideas. I'm trying to expand my content as well. So just stay in tune.